yeah, we're gonna do more Animal Crossing now. I noticed that um, new village is in place. Wait, did I say the usual thing? <laughs> it's alright. I've had a long day, but in case I haven't, I'll say if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. And hope you have been enjoying. It's okay. It is Friday. Alright. I haven't done a ceremony in a while. Okay, well, this is all good because I have stuff to sell. Immediately first thing, go solve. Money will be acquired. First visit since renovated. You can see we're operating out of this new space. Hope you continue shopping with us. Jeez. That's expensive. Very expensive. Um, I mean, I might be able to afford it. I forgot to do the fossils. Find out how much 24 islands of fruit is worth. Oh crap, there's one on the shelf. That's going into storage. Take three trips. I 
think that's a spare. And there's still fruit today as well. Hopefully that's enough. Oh yeah, I gotta remember to leave some. Just for uh, crafting and consumption's sake. And it was at least a hundred thousand bells. So. Honestly, worked out pretty well in the end. Feel so empty, I had so many knock miles. Okay. that thing to spend knock miles as well, so hang on. I'll buy it a ticket and I'll just keep it in storage. Uh, 
it's worth getting if it's going to give me some miles back. And I am going to use it eventually once I do kick out the other villager I want to get rid of. That's not a waste. start that process again of just saving as much as I can. Okay, yeah, this is a hot item. Classic picture. Oh, lucky. That's a good one to have. Of clay I can use. Uh, not really. Okay. I'll at least do a stack of it. what to do. Like, there's two things I can do today. Go for one of the remaining fish that I need for this month, or start grinding the whole I might do the fish thing, because I still have all that bait that I don't really get to use. Grow fruit trees. Ugh. Maybe plant two more palm trees. How many do I need? Do two or three? One. Oh, that's easy. I'm just gonna plant one. I haven't played this in a few days. <laughs> I haven't gone for money for it. It's just, I needed a break after that island thing. Spending four hours just jumping island to island looking for a villager. That's not too bad. Okay, the last one is plant fruit trees and then I guess we'll see. I was worried I might have offended you or something. No, I was just playing other games. <laughs> I 
What's up, governor? I'm so glad I got to see you in your explorer shirt, because you're rocking it. I think that color you're wearing would go ele would go really well with an elegant hat. I see my hunch is right, so here's a gift for you. Wow, that's so nice. See, that's not so much a guilt trip. <laughs> Elegant hat. Okay, are you gonna warm up to my elegant hat? Um, you're well, right? It's the hat, it did it. Wait, what just happened? I don't think I've ever heard you call a customer by name before, sis. Hush, Mabel. You know this is hard for me. Anyway, I'm Sable. I figured it was time we introduced the group to you You can go back to shopping now. That's a school uniform. Noble pants. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah! It's a tiny hat. That's the YouTuber hat. I feel like I'm gonna sing with an acapella group or something. the only thing missing. Okay. <laughs> Very fancy. At last as well. What did I do while you were gone? I'll see. I mostly watched kung fu movies in my basement and then made kung fu movies in my basement. And then waited for my arms to heal. Did you know that no one can hear me screaming from my basement? Anyway, welcome back. What do you mean no one can hear you scream from your basement? Uh, <laughs> that's, a, that's a hell of a... Uh, campaign to get KK to notice our island going so far. Here's something else for you. I was sorting through things and came across my portable record player. It comes from off-island but still thought it might help. It might. Yeah, 
maybe here. Exercise or do the exercise thing. It is quick. What's that sound? Sound like something falling over. This is the new house. Oh, and you're talking to Hi, I was inspired to move here after the last time we ran into each other. The other islanders I met so far have been great to me, so I feel like I'm in the right place. But it's good to know you'll be nearby. up to. 
I'm currently crafting a pretty Cosmos Wreath just to see how I do it. DIY yeah, is a great way to learn by doing. I'm totally obsessed with it. Well, want to learn how to make your own pretty Cosmos Wreath? Sure. All right, I write down all the details right here. Should be easy for you. I'm gonna try when you have the time and materials, bud. Good evening, evening, Foxtrot. What's the latest? I'm practicing striking a pose. It's important to life skill. No, no, when you might need to pose. The game is much louder than me. Or am I just like leaning back in my chair? <laughs> Hold on. into it later. <sighs> Windows did another update and I'm guessing it's fucked with my audio. But thank you for letting me know. Hopefully that's better. Oh, the, it, was a, it was a good update as well. Like, they enabled a search bar in my taskbar that I turned off when I first installed Windows. It popped up and it said, hey, do you want to use a search bar, or should we undo this? Great update. Thank you for restarting my computer overnight, Microsoft. I know that it was a critical update you had to install to enable your search services. <laughs> um, what does one find appealing about these chill games? I mean... For me, it's not just chill games, it's more of a... I like games where you start with nothing, or the concept of nothing, and then you do whatever you need to do to build yourself up to something. 
In the case of this, this is just, you fill the game up with the villages that you like visually, or whatever. Um, you build your island how you want it to be. You pay off your loans, it's just... You start off in a tent, and then you end up with a house and a town that you decorate in whatever way you want. But that sort of concept also applies to like a game to say like Diablo. Alright. Diablo. You start off with a weak character, you play through the game, you level up, you gain new abilities, you put points into your character, you get gear. And it's that set it ticks the same part of my brain. It's just like starting with nothing and you slowly build your way up to something larger. And it's all through your own choices and, I guess, personal tastes, so. There can be a lot of work, but, I mean, any game is a lot of work if you put enough time into it. I think the reason these games are a little more... I'm gonna say questioned, is just because there's no... There's no real overarching plot there's no clear go to A, then go to B, then go to C, or like you have a choice between A, B, and C. It's kind of just play the game. But yeah, I mean, that's why I personally enjoy them. It's just. At the end of the day, I'm thinking about what I want to do next, and what I want to upgrade, what I want to get next, what I want to make my island look like in the end. And then just working towards it. And it's just my way of relaxing, that's pretty much it. Oh, I wasn't quick enough. second too slow. How was day slash work? Uh, yeah, I mean, just busy. I'm just glad it's Friday, so I don't have to think about work for the next couple of days. But I opened up with this just to kind of unwind before I get into games that involve thinking, strategy, reflexes. Should be an okay weekend. Granted, I do gotta go vote tomorrow, but... I have to... If I don't get up early, it's just gonna take a while, so I'm gonna have to try and get up early tomorrow and get it out of the way. from that. Yeah. Hopefully catching up with a friend over the weekend as well, so should be alright. Never voted. If you feel to duty as a citizen. Well, this is one of these things that my perspective on it is a bit skewed. And that's just because in, in Australia it's compulsory. So there's no choice of the matter. Now whether or not that should be the case, I don't know. It's just not really something I've ever thought about. And it's not really a can of worms <laughs> I want to open, but yeah, that's, that's my answer for now. Like, yeah, I don't, I don't have a choice, it's just, you do it. There are reactions for everything. When you're sleepy, you can use, wait for it, sleepy. Somebody sees you do that and they'll know you've been up all night. Oh, 
never knew it was mandatory in Australia. I think a, a few countries have it as mandatory. It's not just us. The way voting here works is different as well. Like it's done on a preferential system, which again, I'm not gonna explain, but it's it's very different to how it works in America. Or like, who, who else uses America's voting system? For the life of me, I can't remember. I feel like one other country does. Hang on. Um, how do I edit my reactions wheel? Not that one. Oh, there we go. Surprise, shock. I mean, surprise and shock seem to be. Fearful, less sleepy. Playing a game like this for people, wait, playing a game like this for people that like this sort of game is the fact that there's no stress compared to a game and you can die. That can be stress. <laughs> That's just a different kind of stress sometimes. What was nice about this game is just in the time period that I got into this one in particular was during the pandemic where you couldn't go out and see people. And people were using this as a virtual hangout sort of thing, and it was nice. And just, you know, no matter how crappy things were outside, but kind of, it was kind of nice to have this. Hey, cat, how's it going? Yeah, so it was nice. I mean, the creator of this game, primary reason of designing the game is more or less to feel less lonely. It was just, there's a whole story about it, but yeah. It's like, you, it represents something that, a place that you can go to every day and people are happy to see you. And that's, that's all it is. I have one more look around, but I feel like I've got all the fossils. Oh, I've got all this here. Yeah. I'll do that later. We'll see how late I stay up today. If I stay up late, uh, I'm not sure I can get up early to get the voting stuff out of the way. I, I need to make that effort, I think. Even, even if I do stay up late, it's just so much easier because the lines, they get pretty lengthy. And I think it's going to be raining tomorrow, so to get caught in a line when it's raining, yeah. Get up, go do it, <laughs> come home, and then just go back to sleep. I'll come back. Oh yeah, right. You're awake now. 
It still hasn't clicked like that it's night time, but the, the sun is still out outside. <laughs> It's 7 p.m. It's still, there's still light outside. surprising. Only... Only two out of all those. I think this is a new dinosaur. I don't think we've heard anything about it. Parasolophus. I like to think of it as the beast with the golden tones. You see, the three-foot structure of hollow bone atop its head may have been an elaborate noisemaker. As a dyed in the feathers optimist and music fan, I like to think of think it serenaded the late crustaceous. And that is why what I have to say about that. Hmm. Done with the fossils, the art is the source. I was just about to say, I really wish the art would turn up more often. Like, I think I got maybe eight pieces of art on my first island. Here I have two. Okay, this is done. Go for it. Ankylosaurus was the herbivore hero, the grazing gladiator, the vegetarian barbarian of antiquity. Between its club like tail, heavy armor, and honest to goodness spikes, it was a formidable beast. Can you keep a secret? I have even heard recent theories that it actually attacked Pretzels. Can you imagine such a behavior in a herbivore? It simply beggars the imagination. Okay. Oh, it's a milestone. So what, um... I mean, that, that doesn't represent how far I'm into it, so... Okay. Stand first on Harvey's Island. Yeah, that's right. The whole Harvey Island. I should visit Harv's Island. Because I think it. There might. I might be far enough. So hang on. What do I got here? This is. Diplo tail. So I got Diplo tail and Diplo chest. stars, yeah. I mean, I should check in with Visible and see how I'm going. Oh, no, yeah, that's great. Oh, no, this is four pieces. I just want something outside the museum, that's all. So, I'd, I've completed the mammoth. It'll be the mammoth and something else. Um... Plessio skull, spino skull, anklio tail. I need anklio body because that's anklio over there. What's this one? Spino skull. Wait, diplo skull. Oh shit, it's part of this. Where was that? 
Wait, am I wrong? Oh, hang on. Which one's this? This is... Diplo tail tip. Oh, Diplo is massive. I might not use this one. Diplo is five pieces. Plesio, Mammoth, Parasaur, Spino, Ankle. Alright. Wait, what is this one? T Rex tail, right. I was trying to form a T Rex. I mean, it would be cool to do these two, but I think they're just too massive. I've been waiting on is like the pattern browser. I can't remember where I got that from. I thought about it yesterday. It may be something that the DLC gives you, so I may have to go to work to get that. Because I had it at that point, so. where you can go freely browse patterns. Where you can type in a term or like an ID and then you can browse a pattern. Because I have the pro one, but I don't have the browser yet. And I think it's either something I get after three stars or I have to go to work. talk to the hedgehog at the able sisters that says a bunch of times oh cool i've been doing that today she warmed up so i'm guessing tomorrow we'll be at the point where it's beyond that she said hi and introduced herself today okay so i just need one more then i just need the diplo neck i think this is too massive but It's okay. I'm thinking the Anklia and the, the Mammoth would be a good two. Okay, I know this bug is worth a bit. I don't think I ever got that far. I would have probably been close. I'm not sure I'm gonna play the DLC to that extent. The other one is this 
shopping with special goods. Yeah, that one I was aware of. As, once you find an item, you can buy it again from there. Because... <laughs> I remember when I got the bed. I got the... The Oriental style bed very early on. And when people used to visit my island, they'd be like, Hey, can you pick up your bed and put it down so I can pick it up? So it registers that I've found it and then I can buy it. I had to do that multiple times. out as well. Almost back up to 10,000. Water produce, that's an easy one. I guess it means next week it should be time for that bubble to pop up again. sell enough fruit today. It was a hundred and fifty thousand bells worth of fruit. If not more. Hold on. Oops. I think 
that's a big shadow. At some point I will make an effort to do the hundred in a row and I'm just going to do it how I did it last time, just little shadows only. Because then there's no pressure and even if I mistime it, it's still fine. I don't have to feel like there's a rush. I just, I'm kind of dreading but the new computer is just putting Windows 11 on it. I've just heard that if I, if I find Windows 10 annoying with all its random updates that do all that service shit, that 11 is worse. Like it's more notorious in that regard. Like, even today, I had to... So usually the way it happens, I end my stream and I put my VODs to upload to YouTube overnight. So then it's like, cool. The next day, I just have to make a thumbnail and they're done. I go to check it today, my computer restarted. Oh, there was a Windows update. That's weird. One happened the night before. I guess it must have been an emergency update. I log into my computer and the update basically just enabled the search bar and I was so annoyed. It's just, hey! We noticed that you turned off Windows Search in your taskbar. We've enabled it again for you. Would you like to keep this change? Oh my god. Yes, thank you for interrupting my file uploads to restart my computer to re-enable that. Alice has got fleas. Hold on. Oh, perfect timing. Take this nurse's jacket. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay. Why do you have a nurse's jacket, Phil? Phil just talked about his basement. Um, my skin started crawling earlier. Phil said his basement. You can't hear people scream. Governor, flee on me. I'm embarrassed you had to see that. But thanks for your help. I'm going to clean this up. This is way too many flowers for this area. I might look at the layout I need to take for these just to... Get the better flowers. I think there's enough space to do it though. But it does also appear that it's messed up my audio settings because it seems that the capture volume is a lot louder. For some reason, I have no idea why. Oh. I think I know what it is. Okay. I know what it is. It's because it's done this shit. Um, I won't be able to fix it now, I don't think. No, no. There's, there, there's something definitely wrong. Hang on. Ugh. 
<sighs> this just makes this update that they've done that much more annoying. Alright, let me see if I can maybe get it to do it. Uh, yeah, it's not gonna work unless I restart. Alright, well... trying to think of an easy way to do this. Let's just do it this way. I'll lower the volume a little bit more. You're not always wrong, by the way. Sometimes it is the case, cat. It just makes it that much more annoying. It's like, okay, so you restarted my computer, you cancelled my up, my uploads, and you fucked around with my audio settings just to re-enable your search service on a taskbar that I told explicitly that I don't want that shit already. It's okay. I mean, I have to restart the stream anyway when I go play Sea of Star, so I'll just fix it then. But I might have to, like, apply a compressor or some shit to the audio track later. It's fine for now. It is, yeah. But I think the first couple of minutes of this would have been a little bit bad. So sorry if the sound is a bit different if you're watching this later on YouTube. This is just something that every streamer goes through if they use any sort of mixing, which basically everyone does. It's just Windows, every now and then will have an update and it just completely screws over your audio settings. Like you have to redo the part where you're saying, oh hey, apply the filters to my microphone. probably hear background noise as well. Like, the microphone's just not gonna sound well. In fact, let me hear myself. Hmm. That was a little bit of a harm. Okay, but it's definitely not, like, usual volume. Okay. Now, people joke about Macs just, if you want to use it for gaming, haha, you're shooting yourself in the foot. I get that. But I'll tell you what, macOS does not do this shit, where it's just constantly asking... It's not constantly asking me to use Apple's services. It's not undoing my settings in order to do that. Like, it's just so... It's almost to the point where it's spyware now. This is probably the worst one, because it did it yesterday, and it's done it again today. all the fruit, right?
guess I need to decide what I'm gonna... What I'm gonna aim for now. I don't need any more inclines. I don't need any more bridges for now. At least for the three-star rating. Like, I don't want to get into the whole laying down bridges thing until I form the island more or less how I want it to. Okay. Ask Isabel. I think the house, there's probably another house upgrade that I'll, I'll ask anyway. I could just keep putting money away for now. I must thank you for your diligent repayment of your home loan. Yes, yes, I must ask for your payments motivated, but yeah. Okay, good news. I mean, gonna do this anyway. The fuck? I won't sit down. There we go. Jeez, I was holding it. Um, about my home. I want to expand. That's the big one. Okay, well, big home coming. I'm leading a task force that comply compiles feedback to the image of our island. Okay, it's just me though. I wanted to have a task force in my very own. Anyway, I won't bore you with the details. Feel free to ask. Okay, um, island evaluations. Okay, collects, analyzes, blah, blah, blah. First, I conduct polling. The feedback is ranked on the well known five star system. The better the balance of natural beauty, development, and decor, the more stars the island receives. Means more residents, buildings, proper infrastructure. Okay. <laughs> We've built a solid reputation and come up during many a water cooler. Allow me to read an excerpt from the feedback that I gathered. Shamblonia, man, hearing about how chill it is. I'd go if I had the chance. Dash KS. Do you have it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Am I hallucinating or was that feedback signed by a KS? Mm, yes, there it is, very clear. KS and the penmanship is quite striking, if I do say so myself. Could it be? Can it be? It must be! That message is from the one and only KK Slider. What? I can't believe it. We've finally achieved our goal of bringing our island to the attention of the KK Slider. Not only that, but he said he's looking for an excuse to visit. And what are we waiting for? Yes, yes, let's offer him a chance to hold a concert for on our shores. Strike while the iron is hot, they say. Alright, well that's done. Ah, uh, hello. Do I have the pleasure of speaking with uh, Mr. KK Slider? Yes, yes, I'm with Nook Inc. Located on Shamblonia. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. We did. We appreciate your valuable feedback. That's actually why I'm calling. If you're truly interested in visiting Mr. Slider, we would be happy to host you and your musical stylings. Yes, quite. I see. Oh my, you mean? Thank you so much. Yes, I'll be sure to mail you all the details right away. The entire island will be looking forward to it. Thank you again. Yes, yes. Talk to you soon. This is good timing because he usually holds his concerts on the weekend, so there you go. He'll do the concert. That's right, KK Slider is coming here. Amazing. Congratulations, sir. Tomorrow is the fishing tourney, but he's checking his schedule to see if he's available the next day. Sunday? Okay. Can you believe it? We've finally turned our goal into a reality. We'll spread news of the concert via our island broadcast system. Do you hope you'll be in attendance. You must simply hear KK play. Yes, yes, you must. Alright. Hey. Okay. Well, in that case... Wait. I should get these out of the way. This lineup is, is looking a little better. <laughs> Just skeptical mouse needs to go. 
I'd like to begin our special ceremony ce celebrating the grand opening of our fan scene, you Nook's Cranny. Thank you. Thanks to everyone's tireless efforts, Chamberlain is developing wonderfully. Yes, yes. I'd like our Nook's Cranny representatives, Timmy and Tommy, to say a few words. Timmy, Tommy, if you would. Residents of Shamblonia, we've remodeled Nook's Cranny into the wonderful shop you see before you. Yep, and we're offering a wider selection of goods than ever before. It's also we can do a better job of supporting you and this island. Yes, yes, thank you both. Next, a few words from someone who makes many valuable contributions to this island's development. Yes, yes, okay. Uh, as always. Thank you for your heartfelt and encourage encouraging sentiments. Okay. Thank you all. This includes our ceremony. Please do take care on your way home. going to this for some reason. Like, I, I don't know. What date is it? Uh, it's not worth doing this yet. I should do this on the last time I'm gonna play it for the month. Um. Wait a minute, isn't this where you pay off your home loan? How come it's not there? Or is it only gonna start from tomorrow? Yeah, okay. I guess... Just so I'm not carrying excess bells. Alright, I was going to the right area. What have we got on the board right now? Fish, bugs... Probably not gonna do that. I'll do the sea creature thing. I wasn't going to play this long today anyway, because I want to dedicate more time to CS Stars and The Last of Us. I have to finish both those games this week before Mario comes out. I made good progress on The Last of Us last night, so I don't know how much is left of it, but I'd say I progressed pretty well. Please let this be a killy fish. I think it's too early to look for the other fish that I need to get. I don't think that appears until like 9 or 10 p.m.
an easy one. Another fruit tree I missed. I don't bug catching thing yet. Shake the trees around here just so I know that's safe. Piece of ribbon coming out. Ah. Okay. But I guess that's all I needed to do. Still. Alright, back up to 10,000. <laughs> sticks will sell the rest.
am I missing? Wood? Oliver and uh, I guess I may as well do the stone or other thing. Sell or buy? That one might be buy. I put the gothic mirror over there. It's probably quicker for walking to the house at this point. Oh, it's just the not clothing. I don't think I have an outdoor wardrobe actually. <laughs> I'll just go buy a pair of socks or something. It counts. has to be the home mirror. Huh. Or I should just place a fridge outside or something. put too much effort into getting things to three stars. I just worked out. Oh wow. I've never seen them get up that quickly. He didn't say a thing. 
Good morning or evening. Vishun Fajri. How are you this fine, whatever time of day it is? Say, is that my favorite land lover? Well, it is. Ahoy. Good thing your head is so huge. Makes it pretty easy to identify your blurry silhouette. I love that that's the comment he went with, given I have a tiny hat. <laughs> Would you like to hear how I ended up on your beach this time? Yeah, I thought you might. There I was, battling a dozen, no, two dozen sea monsters. I was holding my own until one of them landed a devastating tickle attack, sent me tumbling overboard. Cast sploosh, paddle, flail, blurble, blurble. Next thing I know, I'm being poked back to life on this very beach. Boy. 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 <laughs> Talk about a class called Can You Believe It? Uh, ah. uh, that's your cutie laugh. Have you ever heard these before? Well, I'd love to stay and chat for several more hours, but the ocean is calling my name. Time to summon a rescue. I'll just call for help using my handy dandy, uh... My, oh my gosh! My handy dandy communicator is broken. This isn't handy or dandy. Ah, oh, sardines. It's all cracked and busted. Looks like it's missing a few communicator parts, too. That means I'll have to wait for my crew to find me on their own. Hmm, that could take a while. I've only got enough nautical parts the last couple of hours. You! Yes, you. Will you help me find my communicator parts? I'll look for them. Really? Wow, I haven't gotten a reception this sweet and bubbly since I was washed up at old Carl Cola. The communicator parts are probably buried in the sand somewhere. I'm just missing five parts, finally. Okay. Yep. Good. Hmm. So, I have three stars on my island. Does that mean I can visit half now, or do I have to wait for the concert? Because if I could set that up now... I do have 200,000 in the bank after the concert. Damn. I might just save the money for that. Yeah, keep the money on hand, not put it to the mortgage. I need you. If I want the benefits of the DLC but don't want to decorate a whole house, people just speed run by placing two to three required items. Right. Maybe. We'll see how I feel. I think I can get the model now. I'm probably not gonna look into that until I've at the very least settled on the villages I want in the end, because I don't want any of them going to the island just yet. It just means if they're on the island, I can't encounter them. It'd be disastrous if, like, one that I want, or I guess would want to have, is on the island. See how I feel about it. Hold on. Fast food cap. Uh, what? Really, it must have been someone else. Oh well. You know how you're always doing nice things for me. Well, the other day I couldn't help buying a fast food cap, and now I can't help giving it to you. 
It'd make me super happy if you'd accept it. We'll keep it in mind. Thank you for letting me know about the workaround. Oh. Oh, that's what it meant. I thought it was like... That doesn't really look like a fast food cap. I thought it was going to be one of those um, caps that they wear at certain burger restaurants or like the donut shop. The paper cap. That's what I was expecting. I'll probably be patient enough to at least do the houses. Like a little white cap, yeah. Alright, the pieces are crammed back in there. Let's see if I can get this thing to message. So, hi there, it's me, crew. Blah, 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 blah. Same text as usual. fast food and didn't have to wear one of those caps, but... My brother did work at the first Krispy Kreme in Australia, and they had those caps, but they didn't have to wear them, I guess they were, uh, what do you call them? Novelty. You could ask for them. I guess I associate it because there was that movie, Good Burger. From Keenan and Cal, and yeah. They wore those little hats. Maybe that's where I'm getting that picture from. We had baseball caps that were part of our, our uniform. It was a polo shirt, just for some reason, dress pants, well I guess they weren't dress pants, they were just more formal pants than one would expect. And then the hat. That clothing just could never get the smell out of that clothing. I remember I, I took time off that job for a month. <laughs> Those clothes got washed like at least six times and just the smell of chicken just would not leave them. You'd think I'd be put off eating chicken after that, but not really. I would often go to work, come home. What's for dinner? Chicken. Oh, great. I'll just sit down and eat this. No problem. Thanks for your generosity, man. Alright, Stoner Otter. Give us the knowledge. Since you were cool, I left you something you'll dig. While I'm at it, let me lay some truth on you. The deep kind. Feel this. Happy as a clam isn't about how happy you are. It's about being the kind of happy that climbs up. Wrap your noodle around that. Yep, today is a good day. Uh, I don't think I have 5,000 gold, gold bells worth of secret as yet, so... I'll just swim around and get that real quick.
I mean, you would think after about 10 critters I should have it. Get a high value on. Uh, oh no, this is something. Oh, this is new. Okay, I gotta go donate that. Even though it probably would sell well. milestone for the diving. Okay, well, I have that crab already, but that, I guess, covers it. Alright, that definitely got me my $5,000. Oh, there you go. Good. Pile on the miles. I'm gonna need them. Lobster is rather famous for its two large claws, but did you know that in fact it has six claws in total? Of course, the four tiny claws aren't as threatening as large its larger crusher claws. Is. That pincer can put a hundred pounds of pressure on in a pinch. Just a little something to bear in mind when a lobster tries to shake your hand. There you have it. Okay, cool. No. <laughs> I mean, even this outfit, like I'm... Definitely dressed like someone in the 1930s going to the beach.
very quick, very quick, very quick. I think I have three by now. I have two. Damn. Okay. I'm leaving it here for today, keeping it short because I want to get to Sea of Stars and The Last of Us, but also I need to go reconfigure my microphone. So apologies if the audio has been a little quieter or maybe worse than usual. Just you can blame Microsoft and it's just annoying thing with Windows Update, just constantly messing with settings. It, it is what it is, but yeah, sorry if it affected the quality of things. Anyway, uh, we'll do more of this over the weekend as uh, the concert is on Sunday, so probably do more then. But yeah, till next time, uh, thanks for sticking around to the end if you're watching on YouTube, if you want to support the channel, just click buttons like the thumbs up button or uh yeah watch any of the other two videos that have popped up on your screen but till next time bye youtube